Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy Tactics Rebirth. Uh, first of all, I just wanted to take a look at our characters because they've changed quite a bit. Um, as you can see, Ramza now has Fly equipped. So he's ready for the next battle. And he also gained Angel Song, uh, gives us MP, Battle Song, gives us uh, physical attack power. And finally, uh, oh sorry, he already had Nameless Song. So we just got that close to and fly. Uh, now, Rad. Uh, Rad has gained Sandstorm. Not Darude Sandstorm, but real Sandstorm. And uh, we're just waiting with Alicia. We're going to uh, grab Odin with her, I think. It's uh, quite a good skill. I like it. Although Cyclops is another good option. Uh, we'll just have to see how we feel with that. Then uh, Lavian is... Uh, she just um, is waiting to get Fly close to getting it, but uh, not quite there. It's much better than Jump Plus 3, um, because if we look at the Lancer, see that they have a skill called Ignore Height, and jumps to any height regardless of jumping ability. So Jump Plus 3 is considerably worse than Jump Plus Infinity. Um, that's just a fact. So we will of course be getting Jump Plus 3 eventually, because we're going to master the job, uh, but um, I don't see us using it. And on the other hand, uh, the skill move plus three, um, the bard, I think, definitely has its uses depending on the map drawn. Alright, I think we're all good then. Um, Agrius uh, is not quite ready to get to gain JP. Uh, as for this, uh, Brave story, um, if you look at this, you can see it's changed, obviously, since the last time we looked at it. Um, I, I, one of the members on the uh, Something Awful forums mentioned that uh, at the beginning of Act, or uh, sorry, Chapter 2, um, Ramza's name changes from uh, Ramza Beowulf to Ramza Ruglia, I believe it is. Uh, and this is the assumed name that Ramza takes uh, while he's working as a mercenary. And uh, that dialogue we had in the previous mission, uh, where Gafgarian was talking to Agrius and saying, you didn't know that Ramza was a Beelv? Um was an allusion to Ramza having changed his name. And, uh, you know, uh, it's never mentioned directly in the dialogue, that's the closest it comes to being mentioned. Um, and that just goes to show that, you know, uh, Ramza was... had kind of taken Gafgarian into his con uh, his confidence and uh, had told him secret that he was actually a Beowulf. So uh, it shows that he did trust Gafgarian to a considerable degree probably not the case anymore. Um, and I did want to make a small correction, perhaps a big correction. All right, I said that the setting in this game was called Ivalis, and the kingdom is called Omdolia. But that's not true. It's not true. Um, in Final Fantasy XII, the setting is called Ivalis. In Final Fantasy Tactics, this kingdom, the Ak Atkasha Kingdom, is also called Ivalis. Okay. And... Uh, yeah, so... What that means is that uh, it's actually not 
uh, this kingdom that's called uh, Omdolia, but uh, rather it there is a neighboring kingdom called Ordalia. That's the kingdom they were fighting in the Fifty Years War. So, Ivalis, the kingdom of the Atkashas, was fighting Ordalia in the Fifty Years War, which is the kingdom to the east. Uh, we will get close to it near the end of the game, but uh, we're not actually ever going to go there. Um, it is uh, also um, present in Final Fantasy XII, uh, where it's to the west of the area in which the game takes place. But um, I believe you also never visit there uh, in Final Fantasy XII either. Uh, you go to the east of the original starting uh, position, but you never go all the way to the west, and you don't travel all the way to the area that we are calling Ivalis here. Uh, translation issues, uh, inconsistencies between games in the series, all these kind of things, it makes it very confusing. Anyhow, here we are, Boreas Valley, we're going to Lionel Castle, and we are going to fight the fateful duel with Galarian. All right, um... This is confusing. I believe the way this works is that the front of this battlefield actually puts you up against the wall, and the back puts you towards the enemies. Again, uh, my complaint about the deployment screen in this game and how it's, it's really quite uh, holds true. Used to hold true. Alright, that was exactly what I wanted. Very good. Gald, yes. We go with Nameless Dance, as we do. Wait, frequently. Uh, Ramza is just gonna fly away. Leave Gafgarian standing high and dry behind the castle wall. Since I uh, kind of have to do this, I guess I will. <laughs> Um, I, think I can get away with one round of Nameless Song and then I will switch over to Life Song. decide what the best option would be for her here. I think these two would be a solid choice, uh, but so would hitting these two. I think I'm going to go after the summoner because it's always a good idea to get rid of the summoner.
that was an interesting decision for that night. Uh, I'm not going to complain about it. Okay, tackle. Well, alright. I guess, you know, maybe the, the AI was like, well, it could try to get through her shield, but that's probably not going to work. And uh, therefore, I will just go ahead and use tackle. <laughs> Dean Damage, come on. Who's to complain? Doesn't it always come down to you just using Bahamut? Come on, give me something! Oh! Kidding me. Alright, that's that's pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, that was respectful. Oof. Oof. Too bad. Luckily I'm in a position where I can bring Ramsa back to life. Or actually he had re-raise, so... Yeah. Um, I'm gonna switch over to Life Song. It's really the appropriate course of action. I think I'm going to switch over to Wizard Abyss at this point. She is going to save her mana. Sure.
we're pretty much good on life at this point. Actually, I can't, I can't do any physical damage with my Geomancer because his weapon's broken. Okay. Uh, it does allow him to do one thing that will be useful for us, though, which is going to be punching Lavia in order to activate a save for her. Yeah, so I was wondering if that would be able to increase um, damage of Wisnibus, and I believe that actually will. It's going to be nice. Yeah, you might notice that uh, although I was able to fly down castle walls. I'm not so sure I'll be able to fly back up. Imagine how strong a party of four dancers and rams as a bard would be in some cases, uh, where you could just have battle song going with four wizard of pisses. Gate Gafgarian, is that what you're gonna do? Say so yeah, I blame you. Puncher! Oh yeah. One strong punch. Doesn't even have martial arts. Next round of actions, I will turn uh, Ramza back to life song. And, uh, yeah, I am just waiting here for these corpses to turn over so that I can uh, grab some items. some skills if I get lucky.
Frankly, I think we might be able to punch F. Curry into death by the time we're done with this. <clears throat> I'm going to continue to conserve those magic points. Not really much she can do. I guess I could go an anchors a bit, but even Ramza seems pretty much it's a little bit risky. But too bad. Just gonna run in the corner. <laughs> I think he might be trying to open the gate. Might have caught on. to my summoner would have been a better choice but maybe there'll be some more silly way to uh, finish this mission, but using the bard in a one-on-one -on -one duel is a silly choice. Oh, he's just gonna hide in the corner and wait to die. Sad end to a great mercenary.
Her model is alright. I'm going to go for martial arts though. He'll be done for soon, ish. the end for you, Gafgarian. Danced into oblivion. Might as well spell just to gain her some job points with her. She could really, really use them. This is the end for you, friend. Insult to injury, Rams is even singing after he died. Alright, well, um, that was a somewhat silly way to carry out that battle, but it did work in the end. Um, Just to say something about Gafgarian and Rams's relationship, as I said before, you can kind of think of Gafgarian as Rams's second father figure in his life, the first one being his real father, Balbanes. Um, and what we saw in the previous mission, where he finally rejected the life of a mercenary and, and he strongly um, attacked Gafgarian to the point of now having killed him um, showed that Ramza rejected the principles of Gafgarian his first, or his, se his second father, in the name of the principles of his first father Albanes, right? Um, Albanes told him to never tolerate injustice and to follow his heart 
and those are exactly the principles that Ramza used in his argument with Gafgarian in a previous mission. Um, and now this is just closure, in a way. Um, he's decided to not only uh, change his name, as he did um, at the end of the last mission, but now to uh, really end things by uh, killing Afgarian. That's it. I think you get some decent skills from Yafgarian's crystal, but uh, obviously it's not really an option with uh, Bard, and it's not really relevant either because well, he's a bard. He's not going to be using knight skills of any sort. Alright. Um, we're now going to save here and prepare for our first uh, battle with the Lukavi. Uh, we'll be coming up in the next episode. So if you enjoyed this one, despite its silliness, uh, please like and subscribe. And uh, I will be uploading the next video uh, probably tomorrow.